Hello crafty friends, it's Erica, Scrapdiva29. Welcome back to my channel. I am coming on today with an Amazon haul and some online hauls I wanted to share with you. I have been a busy little bee and I am trying to get myself organized. I am so behind on organizing my stamps and my dies, but I, I really have to stop and really start organizing. So what I picked up on Amazon, um, what you're looking at right here is this um, Brother P Touch, and this is my label maker. Um, I did pick it up off of Amazon. Uh, many of you all know I am a Prime member on Amazon, so I love using Amazon to order because you can get things super fast, and normally um, you get it at a great price, and sometimes it's even a lower price if you're a Prime member. I just wanted to put that out there. Um, so this is the... Um, uh, printer that I have, my label printer that I have to label my stuff so I can organize. And um, I was out of the labels. So what I did was I went on Amazon and I found an off brand. It's not the brother brand, brother brand um, replacement tape, but it's an off brand. And I'll link it in the description box below if you want to try this out or if you have this particular a label maker. Um, I'll leave it in the description box below so you can find it. But this is the 12, mi 12 millimeter and it's laminated and it's white. So when you print it off, it looks like this. So I just went ahead and uh, typed out Halloween stamps. And so now I can organize um, this bin right here and uh, create a file for Halloween stamps. And I can just turn this on really quickly so you guys can see, um, let's see. I can, let me just go out of here. I'll clear this out and show you how simple it is to use this if you haven't seen this or used it before. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and put in Christmas. I'll do Christmas and then I'll do a space and I'll just do Christmas stamps. And I've already inserted the um, replacement into this machine and it works. All you do is hit print and I only want one copy and you hear it, it's coming out right there. Really, really awesome. And then this little piece right here just cuts it. And then voila, I have Christmas stamps. So now I have a label for Christmas stamps. I absolutely love this. It has a lot of options on it and I highly recommend this for organizing your crafty supplies. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, the next thing that I picked up on Amazon is this art glitter glue and and another metal tip. For whatever reason, I always lose that little um, pen. It drives me absolutely nuts, but you, it's actually a necessity for the art glitter glue. If you don't keep the pen in it, 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 it's hard and it dries up and then you can't get your glue out and then it's a, just a big old mess. And then if you use a regular pen like from like the sewing section at Walmart, it will actually leave rust in the little nozzle tip. So when you when you are you know when you're trying to get your glue out it'll turn orange it'll look all rusty and it's not a good look so anyway you really need the metal tip that comes with the art glitter glue i highly recommend this glue i use it all the time especially with that nozzle it's a fine tip nozzle i'll kind of zoom in so you can see a little bit better fine tip nozzle for you know tiny embellishments that you're gluing um you know tiny word embellishments I'm sorry uh, just it's an awesome tip and I, I love this glue this is one of my favorites if you guys have noticed in my um, description videos um, uh, in the description box I have a link to my Amazon influencer page that page is items that I have created to share with you guys to show you what I actually use on a daily basis um, I do receive a small commission. It's not much, I promise you. And it's no additional cost to you to use my, um, my link and to shop the products. It's no additional cost. Um, I do receive a small commission and it's probably enough to buy some more glue and that is about it. <laughs> and it's, it's just, it's not a lot. But um, I have it on there because I get asked all the time, Erica, what is your favorite glue? What die cut machine do you use? What do you recommend? That is why I created that influencer page. So if you get a moment, check it out. Um, 
and you can shop the products that I actually use on a daily basis. So I'm putting that out there. Okay, so the next thing that I picked up off of Amazon is this clear bin right here. And as you can see, I have a ton of stamps in here uh, that I need to organize and I just needed another bin for stamps. I actually need several more bins to be honest with you, but I just picked up um, a couple. And so I'm just gonna share this one today. And this is what it is. It's this um, Enter Designs Kitchen Bins, and it's made for um, your, you know, your refrigerator or your pantry. But I'm obviously using it for my craft products. Um, this is six by ten by five, and it fits these my stamps in here perfectly. If I wanted to insert my dies with the sleeves that I use from Avery L. It will not work in this particular size. You would need to get a different size um, for those um, uh, to store your dies, just FYI. But anyway, I picked this up specifically for stamps, so um, I really like the clear option. I like the clean look. And then um, <clears throat> I'm gonna go ahead and move on into my online hauls. Um, I picked up a few stamps, and I'm trying to get this right. Let me see. Okay, so I did go to CC Designs and I did pick up some stamps from CC Designs, but I also did pick up, I believe I picked up this stamp set from Not Too Shabby. Um, she was having a sale on her Christmas stamps. I think it was like, I can't remember, it was a few days ago. And I picked up this one from her store, so Not Too Shabby. And I'll leave the links in the description box below if you wanna go and check out these stores and support these stores, um, definitely do that but that was from Jamie's shop. And then I actually went to the CC Designers website to pick up these, uh, these um, stamps right here. So I had to have this one. This one had been on my wish list for a while and I just love that little fawn and I'll definitely use it for Christmas and I just love the little saying. It's absolutely adorable. And then I picked up this one and this one had been on my wish list since last year. My friend Tina, who is Tina Kappa here on YouTube, she made me a Christmas card using this little girl and I, I just thought, oh my gosh, I really want that stamp. And it's actually my favorite Christmas card that I ever have and I, I just love it. And I'll definitely be displaying it um, at Christmas time. And then I had to pick up this one and I just thought she was absolutely adorable, the little ladybug girl. And she is a rubber stamp in case you're wondering and the, these, this one is a rubber stamp as well. And then obviously this one is a clear stamp. And then the one that I picked up from Not Too Shabby is a rubber stamp. And she is a good size doll. I like the size of this one. So super, super cute. I love CC Design. So, um, you know, check out their store. They always have good deals. Um, and then I also, I'm just going to pull the other one that I, sh this other store that I shopped at. It's called Casual Fridays. And um, their packaging was so super cute when I got it in the mail. And I just want to show you the little... Um, this is a little tag that was on my package and you can pause the video if you want to read it but I just thought that was absolutely adorable possible side effects includes inability to do housework laundry pileups forgetting to make dinner grumpy hungry family members may occur um, I just laughed I just thought that was hilarious so anyway I did a haul with casual Friday stamps I'm really excited to show you what I picked up from that store. This has been on my wish list for quite some time and I finally just went ahead and did it and made the purchase. All right, so I picked up this die set and it's a coffee, obviously it's a coffee cup and it has the word coffee and then it has a little mini coffee cup that comes with it and it's like in the shape of a heart. Extra adorable, so um, I can't wait to play with that. And then I picked up the uh, coordinating stamp set and I just thought this was so awesome. It says, ah, everything is okay or now, and then it says possibly vodka. I just had a big kick um, that laughed on that one. I just thought, oh, that's hilarious. And then this one says, Java download in progress, caffeine loading, please wait. And then it says, if you, if, if you can read this, you are too close to my coffee, back away slowly and nobody gets hurt. So um, anyway, it's a super cute stamp set and it goes with that die, so I had to have that. And then I picked up this one and it is a tea sentiment stamped and I just thought it was super cute. It says thank you for your generosity and then it has like even a, like a little tiny 
um, heart inside of the little O, which I thought was absolutely adorable. Peace and love and serendipity. And then you see all the little tiny hearts. It's absolutely adorable. I love this stamp set. Super, super cute. I also have the Mama Elephant teapot die that I picked up a while back and I haven't even played with it yet. So I'll be able to incorporate this stamp set with that die. And that's pretty much why I picked it up. And then I just thought it was just absolutely adorable. And this is the side. My cup runneth over, wishing you, and then a day filled with, love me some. Super, super cute, and I just love the font. Adorable. And then the next one that I picked up is this set right here. And what is this one called? I was trying to see if there's a name on it. But it has all of these different sentiments. It says, I was getting desperate, so at least pretend to like it. You should have, you should know I'm wishing this was all for, oh, it says, I can read you guys, I really can. <laughs> you should know I'm secretly wishing this was all mine. And then this one says, cause I'm awesome like that. And this one says, just for you. You know what this is, just act surprised. <laughs> I put a lot of thought into this and you are so hard to buy for. And then this says, dude, and then girl. And I just absolutely fell in love with this stamp set. I thought this was absolutely awesome for my stash. So I cannot wait to play with this. Love it. This is actually really nice for Christmas time as well. So I picked up this one. And then, um, yeah, so I think, yeah, that's it. I picked up these four from Casual Fridays. I'll leave the link in the description box below. Um, and that is my haul for you guys today. Thanks for watching. Leave me a comment. Make sure you go back and check my pre previous two videos. If you leave a comment on the previous two videos, you will be entered to win a die set. So make sure you do that if you want to uh, uh, win a die. And yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye for now.